Physically trained. He's loading up. He's loading up Adam and he can't afford to do it. Respect. I really do. I think he's, he's hit him. We've got Dylan's respect because Dylan isn't pressing like he would expect. White and, and he's doing it. There's another big right hook. Dylan goes back with another counter to Joseph Fowler. Fighter. I think it's he's fascinating. The, I think he's the better technician on a good right hand. He just looks a lot more, a lot bigger, more solid. That's a great body shot. He whipped in there. He's never been on the floor before. First time he takes a count. Time in his life. That little left hook. He didn't see it, Adam, and that's why I've got me. It came over. It's like a, it's a, it's a, a hook cut, overcut. He just didn't see it. Oh, it's a clash of heads. It's not even a punch. It's a yeah. clash of heads. Yeah, the left hook went in with the heads. That's the Well, it's very unfortunate there for Parker. I mean, he, he took a bad clash of heads there, and that's inspired White. For me, it shows hunger and desire, so I think that it's going to maybe back dictating the pace here. He's slowly walking Joseph Parker down. Yeah, trying to not handle him as well. Utilising the physical strength. Dillian White. It's about the scales. Seems to be hitting harder. You know, they'll be picking up on every single thing that Parker's doing. That's a great job. Tremendous body work. This is Kevin Barry. Such an experienced corner as well. Great fighter he was. And all that time with David Tour and now with Parker. He's been around the block now. Like I said, you know, it's, he's been there, seen it, done it. And I'm pretty sure he's fair where the boxing can't be shown. He wants a rough, rugged... And Dillian White's a hard guy, and he's been through so much in his life already. White. I think we've seen the maturity in these last 12 months, and I really do, I mean. Chasing Deontay Wilder, but so too will Joseph Parker, who turns Dillian White around. It's a good right hand, Adam, that went down the pipe. Dillian White's firing back nicely here. Parker needs to be careful here because he's getting roughed up. Well, to level the score. Parker needs to get a grip and get a hold of this. Can't be touching gloves, Carl, in a fight like this. This is this is a war. This is a hard fight, and no one wants to touch gloves. No, you know the respect can come after the fight. No quarter can be given here. No, you can't right. show too much respect. I totally agree. And Joseph Parker is trying to show Dylan White, and I don't know if that's because he's wanting a, a clean fight or a nice. There's nothing nice about what's going to go down here. He lost his foot and unbalanced at times to Dylan White, and he's got to learn to plant his feet. At I think he envisioned this early doors. Action hotting up here in the sixth round. Joseph Parker does not like this. Good. Close pick up from White. Body shots. They both. I do think he can get it, but can he keep this pace tonight than he did against AJ? But ultimately, that's a good right hand by Dylan White. Big shots from Dillian White and the left hook. And this the time that Lucas Brown. The artillery from White. I think this. that jab from White, and when he chooses to use it, he lands so accurately and he just totally knocks the fire to our opponents. Up close here, Joseph Parker doesn't want to seem to the lighter man who's got a little bit more sharpness to again. Good right hand from Joseph Parker there. It seemed to affect him. White trying to close down. Yeah. Left hand from Dillian White. Parker just being caught more with the jab, Carl. He just doesn't seem switched on up close. He's, he's got no concern with shots coming back. He's got his arms down by his side. He's quite lethargic in his movement. And come on. It's amazing that technically you see he makes so many mistakes, but it's just pure proof. Dave Allen with that win over Nick Well. The Chisora time and his lethargic looking body and he's uninterested from my point of view. It does unless he's waiting for White to fend. 
Sullivan in the second half of the fight. He's just, he's one pace. Wants to be there. Parker said that he was going to go out and, and stop White, take it to him early. And he's pretty, but it's just chipping away. Dylan's looked tired as well in the, in the last couple of rounds with me, but he's just he's grinding it out. And that's the difference. Performer world champion. Right hand from White. Tries to jab, and it's not the quickest. There's some effect though there. No, as Parker works the body, but walks into an upper. Tired. Hands down there from Parker. Round, and it's been Dylan White with everything so far besides the first round. He's not winning pretty, Dylan White. He doesn't need to. To come in this uh, modern heavyweight history, but can work. Parker is the combination right, left foot, straight right, but then be on him with the body, then be back on him again with another cut. and he gets called the left hook and the writing's on the wall now that was a hurt right, he's, he's landed some nice power punches and that left hook was crisp he's beat out of him Carl he's beat the fight out of him big left hook and he's worried about his man here comes the counter from Dylan White great, great catching counter Carl really good counter I mean he took that shot full blooded and he's on his way down there because that's taken our legs from him he I don't took. think he can recover from that he was tired before this he was showing signs of lethargicness and he felt heavy there go for it but that might spell bad news for him, and he might end up leaving this ring on his back because White's looking to... Can he muster something up late on here? He needs it. He must be way behind on the judges' cards. Well, Parker back. Parker needs to then jump on him and work. And now he's on his back foot taking shots. It's the wrong attitude. And he hit the floor again, guys. Good White. right hand, Joseph Parker. White blowing here at this step. You see when he injects that pace, he looks dangerous. Tries the uppercut. Some life still with those legs of Parker. Can he find something from somewhere? To White, not as much, not as many combination punches. So if Parker did have that, he's ten points down. Yeah, enormous lead down in the ninth. And here we go again. You might see the finish line. He's in round 11. He knows there's only six minutes to go. So he just can't seem to have the effect, Parker. And the body shots of White it was so impressive. It is Adam, I'd say, I, I got that wrong saying he had a oh, big shot from Parker, and White has to just take some ground. And that was White's hurt there, hurt, and a right hand from Parker, and White is tired on those ropes. This is extraordinary. Both camps to take this fight at the moment. It the counter punch there. All the weight was in the park and needs to leave every ounce of energy in that ring so he can go home. Oh, he's he's hurt. From right Parker. here. And White is in trouble. That is going to go down here, guys. Parker. He's got to be wise to hold. He doesn't need the exchange here, Dylan White. But he's he's winning. Parker's got two That's minutes good by and Dylan 15 White. seconds to do this. But look at the grit and resilience in Dylan White. He's not going back. Joseph he's Parker should him back. not be holding on here. He should be going for the finish. And here Feet again, Dylan White, but he's showing oh, how to get it on. Right big shot. Parker, the time running out for the New Zealander. White digging in. Parker trying to find the punch. Unbelievable heart here from Joseph Parker. Look at that. Parker goes for it. Late on here in the 12th. Amazing scenes here, guys. Big oh, right hand. He's hurt him. He's, he's gone. He's, he's out gone. on his feet.
judges have it by a unanimous decision. From Brixton, London, the champion, WBO champion, the Irish 